Hi, this is Ivan from Spark Plugin. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a hover reveal effect in Squarespace using Spark Plugin. I'll go through some of the different effects that you can get with the customization because there's a lot of cool ways that you can actually use this. Okay, so first off, let's open up our Squarespace website with Spark Plugin already installed. Now, I've already created several sections using Spark Plugin hover reveal effect. And you can see that it really does take the website to the next level. You've got this type of effect here where it reveals text or an image. Then if we scroll down, we have a list here with an animated hover effect. So when I hover over the image, the text smoothly displays like this. Then the last effect that I'm going to show you how to create is an animated slideshow like this one. Okay, so let's get to it. I'm going to go and start off by creating these first blocks here. So first we click on edit, then add section, add a blank section, and then edit section. Go to colors and choose one of the colors from the theme that you want to use or the theme to fill the background. Next, click on add block and then image position and size your image like this and then click on the title add sign and choose an image that you want to upload into the block now click on add to get the image to fill the entire block go to this edit button right up here then design and fill now let's create the overlay block for this one go to add block but this time choose text and write in your heading now go to the paint bucket and fill it with the color that you want you can either choose the color from palette or a custom one that is entirely up to you then position this directly overlaying the image block below now you can edit the text to see what looks good so i'm going to choose a larger heading size and align it like so. Then we head over to Spark Plugin to work the magic. Click on the block, make sure it's toggled to single. So it's just applying the effect to the single block. Then toggle the hover reveal button. And as you can see, it's now hidden the top block. And that will only show up when you hover over the image like this. Now, if you want to overlay two images then all you have to do is follow the steps as before but this time choose image instead of text again position and resize the block to cover the image block below then click to add an image and then choose edit design and fill now click on the spark plugin icon again and open up the menu Click on the block and toggle hover reveal button. Now you have two images overlaying each other. Don't forget to click on this button right here before moving on. This is very important. Now let's try recreating this list right here. So let's click on add section and choose a style that you want. Under services, you'll normally find the variety of lists that you want to add or that you can add. Now click on edit section and choose one of your theme colors. Then we click on edit content and under elements tab, flick the title and the button toggles to the off position. Flick the show button toggle to on position. Then go to the content tab and choose basic and then just click on replace. This will choose the first of the images on the left. Now we can choose an image to upload. Write in the title, description and button text. Then click the back button to go back to the content options. Now let's go through the same steps for the other image blocks. Now that we have completed the three parts, we can choose a design. I'm going to crop my image to three by four ratio and also I want to change my text size just a little bit here. Okay, let's make this list really pop. Open up the Spark Plugin menu and click on your block. So it only applies to this block and not globally. 
then scroll to lists and carousels and to animated lists carousels. As you can see, it's set to default, but there's a few other options to choose from. Cards will place text into boxes below images and there's also glass morphism effect. We want inset for this effect that I'm doing, so let's just choose that. And now the text and button are overlaying the images. And when I hover over them, you can see that image below now has an animated zoom effect, which is really cool. Next, we click on text hover reveal. And here we have three options. The default setting will keep all text here. The second option is all, where it hides all of the text and hovering it reveals it. And the third option allows just the title to remain and when hovering it will reveal the description and the button in the animated scroll like this. Once you're happy with the way it looks, just click here to publish the changes to your live site. This kind of effect is great for keeping your website looking uncluttered, yet still keeping important information with an easy reach for your audience. So let's move on to the final effect that I want to show you, which is the slideshow right here. Now I could go ahead and recreate it from scratch, but I can also just create a duplicate of the list I have here, which will keep all of the photos, text and design. So all I have to do now is click on edit content, go to design and change it to banner slideshow. You can see that it doesn't have the hover reveal automatically applied as we only apply the effect to the list and not globally. So now we open up Spark plugin again and click on our slideshow. Make sure that single is toggled and then click on animated lists and carousels and then inset. Under text hover reveal, click title only. If you're happy with the way it looks, then all you have to do is click right here and publish it to your live site. And that's it for the hover reveal effect. Have a play around with it and see what you can do to take your website and its design to the next level. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you have any feedback on this effect, then let us know in the comment section. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, then please do so to show us the support. And don't forget to click the bell icon so that you're notified of all of the new content and new tutorials that we are going to be bringing your way. Until next time, bye.